Hello and welcome to Counterexam, the channel where we explore the facts and figures behind the headlines. In this episode, we're going to take a look at the real estate market in Caracas of Venezuela, one of the most turbulent and fascinating cities in Latin America. How much does it cost to buy or rent a property in Caracas in 2023? How have the prices changed in the last decade? And what are the best and safest areas to stay in Caracas? Let's find out. Caracas is the capital and largest city of Venezuela, with a population of about 2.1 million people. The city has been suffering from a severe economic and social crisis for years, marked by hyperinflation, shortages, protests, violence, and political instability. According to the International Monetary Fund, Venezuela's GDP per capita in 2023 is estimated at $9,230, down from $18,000 in 2013. The real estate market in Caracas reflects the complex and chaotic situation of the country. The average price per square foot to buy an apartment in the city center in 2023 is $65, while outside of the center it is $114. This means that a nice two-bedroom apartment in the center would cost around $200,000, while a three-bedroom apartment outside of the center would cost around $250,000. These prices are significantly lower than in other major Latin American cities, such as Bogota, Lima, or Santiago, where the average price per square foot in the city center ranges from $150 to $200. However, the real estate prices in Caracas are not as cheap as they seem, considering the high inflation rate and the low income level of the population. The price to income ratio, which measures the affordability of housing, is 26 in Caracas, meaning that it would take 26 years for someone to pay off a property at the current price and income levels. This is much higher than the global average of 10.6 and the Latin American average of 15. The average monthly net salary after tax in Caracas is only $182, while the mortgage interest rate is 26% per year. This makes it very difficult for most people to buy a property in Caracas, unless they have access to foreign currency or savings. The real estate prices in Caracas have also changed dramatically in the last 10 years, due to the economic and political turmoil in the country. The house price index in Venezuela dropped by 97% from 2013 to 2020, after adjusting for inflation. This means that the real value of properties in Venezuela has decreased by almost 100% in the last decade, making it one of the worst performing real estate markets in the world. The main reasons for this collapse are the hyperinflation, the currency devaluation, the capital controls, the lack of credit, the political uncertainty, and the social unrest that have plagued the country in recent years. The real estate market in Caracas is also very segmented and polarized, depending on the location, the quality, and the security of the properties. There are some areas in Caracas that are considered more upscale, safe, and desirable, where the prices are higher and the demand is stronger. These areas include Chachao, Altamira, La Castellana, Las Mercedes, and El Rosal, which are located in the eastern part of the city, and are home to the financial, commercial, and diplomatic sectors of the city. These areas are also well connected by the Metro Line 1, and offer a variety of shops, restaurants, and entertainment options. On the other hand, there are some areas in Caracas that are considered more dangerous and neglected, where the prices are lower and the supply is higher. These areas include Catedral, La Candelaria, Koch, and Libertador, which are located in the western part of the city and are home to the historical, governmental, and cultural sectors of the city. These areas are also affected by the traffic, the pollution, the crime, and the social problems that afflict the city. If you are planning to visit or stay in Caracas, you should be aware of the risks and challenges that the city faces, and take the necessary precautions to ensure your safety and comfort. You should also do your research and compare the different options and prices that the real estate market offers, depending on your needs and preferences. Caracas is a city with a lot of potential and charm, but also a lot of problems and difficulties. It is not a place for everyone, but it is definitely a place worth exploring. That's all for this episode of Counter Exam. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up, 
subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends. And if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Thank you for watching and see you next time.